Hey, what's going on, guys? Gen Day Commando here, and welcome to the channel, guys. So today we're going to be reacting to the eighth part of the series of Strid's pilot. Can't wait for this one, guys. I'm, uh, yeah, really looking forward to it. As always, I hope you guys are too. We're absolutely hyped for this one. Episode eight. We're flying through this playlist already, guys. It's um, getting to that point where I'm almost going to miss it again, just like the Jaeger Soldat series as it's coming to an end. You know, you kind of think, wow, what am I going to do for a few months? But hopefully they bring more content out in the future, guys, all right? Because I really, really, really enjoy reacting to this um, this kind of stuff, especially for my Swedish brothers and sisters. If um, you're in the chat, then welcome to the channel, guys. Members, thank you very much for supporting the channel. I really do appreciate each and every one of you guys. You know, you're allowing me to continue this dream um, to be able to put content out every single day. You know, uh, it gives me a very good excuse to explain to the wife that I'm doing these videos and you guys are all making it possible so thank you to tier one tier two tier three members you really 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 are appreciated so thank you guys if you want to become a member then all you've got to do is um hit the join button and the link will be in the description guys all right whilst we're on links in descriptions and all of that kind of stuff like share and subscribe to the channel guys if you are not subscribed you need to be because we're doing this every day if you're here right now and you're not subscribed press the subscribe button yeah and please like this video just hit the like it takes two seconds guys all right it helps me out an awful lot discord twitch twitter merchandise instagram tiktok are just a few very um uh, just a few of the social media platforms that i'm actually using at the moment discord is the place that you can recommend content to me twitch is where we go live um on a weekly basis playing different games i'm soon to be getting twitch back up and running um a, a lot more guys all right and yeah my second channel i'll drop a link in the description i'm now not going to be um uploading campaign gameplay um to this channel this channel is strictly for reactions now that's how baby that's what we love okay so all gameplay campaigns will be uploaded to gen dit gaming link is in the description we're still going to go live on the um, on the odd occasion on this channel up until we get enough people to be able to say right we're not going to go live playing games on uh, gen dit commando anymore guys okay but it's just a separated a bit, all right. And um, for the podcasts and stuff that we've got planned, we've got another channel for that as well, Gen Dit Podcast. So that link will be in the description as well, troops. Okay. But enough of me talking now. Let's just get straight into this one, episode eight. I hope you like it, guys. Smash the like. Right then, guys, so is that a better introduction than the Jaeger Soldat series? Let me know in the chat. I think it might be a close. Nu har eleverna kommit hit till Sotenäs och ska genomföra TIS, typ inflygningsskedet. Det är här man flyger JAS-39 och lär sig grundläggande flygning på den. Flygplanet då, JAS-39-gripen som vi utbildar på här, det är ju då ett svenskt flygplan. Och JAS, det står för jakt, attack, spaning. Ja. Right, okay, so they're getting into the real, the big deal aircrafts now. They've done the practicing ones, they're getting into the... The big boys tools, all right. Hunting, um, hunting aircraft. Yeah, it uh, does what it says in the tin, really, guys. Then that these are war machines. Jakt, det är alltså när man bekämpar andra flygplan i luften. Attacken, så när man slår mot markmål. Och S, det är spaning. Eleverna har kommit hit nu och har gjort sig lite hemstadda här på flottiljen. Allt är klart för morgondagen som är den stora, stora händelsen. Det första flygpasset i. JAS 39-gripen och det är, en, det är en sån händelse, det kommer man ihåg resten av livet. Första gången jag satt med JAS 39, då det är ett sånt morospass man gör under utbildningen. Man har precis kommit ner till Sotenäs, flytt SK-60 i Linköping i två år. Förväntningarna var ju jättestora såklart, men man visste att det skulle vara en, en jäkla åktur. Det är mycket prestanda i ett så litet flygplan. Ja, så, yeah, so, you know, from flying the other aircraft, what's going to happen is you're going to be getting, you're going to get used to that as well, aren't you? You're going to get used to the power, the speed, the momentum. 
um, and it's very different in that plane compared to this one. Obviously, this is a this is a proper war machine, okay? Um, like they've explained. So, would the transition be easier for these guys having had that much practice in another aircraft, or would the transition be um, the opposite? You know, because they've done that, would it would it be harder? Would it be a harder transition to go into that? Let me know in the chat, guys. Obviously, I'm not a pilot. I'm a I'm a former infantry an amphibious infantry um, soldier from the Royal Marines Commandos. So it's very very different um, in terms of how we operate. You know. Gett en jäkla massa system och datorer och så har du skruvat fast dem i en rymdraket mer eller mindre och sen så sätter du dig längst fram på den och knyter fast dig så hårt som du bara kan och åker iväg med den. Det är en, du, du, du har verkligen den känslan av att du klär på dig flygplanet. Och blir ett med det. Det är lite sån här, det är en väldigt futuristisk känsla när skärmarna tänds upp och allting. Och den, den kraften du känner i ryggen liksom bara trycker igenom lufthavet. Ja, och all... It must be an unbelievable sensation, guys. They've been building up to this for two years in that other aircraft. To then do this, it must be staggeringly good. All right, I can only imagine the feelings that they're going through now. But they're well equipped and well trained to be able to do that transition, guys. But, um, you know, in terms of them being operational you know they're going to be feeling that they're close to that every single day especially when they get their hands on one of these um, pieces of kits but i reckon the room for error is much less in this aircraft all right it'll be a lot more expensive that's for sure all utrustning är tillpassad eller hur ja så att det finns inga hinder nu inför morgondagens eh, begivelse i att första flygpass i JAS 39 gripen jag vet att ni är lite spända lite nervösa allt kommer gå jättebra. Ni kommer få väldigt många intryck. Så brukar det vara. Men ni kommer framförallt ha en fantastiskt kul dag. Ja, hörni. Nu har vi varit på GTU. Right, so I'm right in saying that this is a different facility completely where they're flying these aircrafts. It is, isn't it? They're not even at the same place as they were last time. They've moved on from that bit. Let me know in the chat if I'm right, guys. Nu på F7, ställer jag flyga JAS. Nästa steg. Hur känns det? Flyga 39. Det ska bli uh, jävligt kul. Alltså, man har ju sett fram emot det här i typ... 4-5 oh. years, that's incredible guys, yeah. I mean, it takes 4-5-6 years to become a doctor and these are, these are becoming pilots in, in, in the same amount of time they have to wait to be able to get their hands on that piece of kit. It's like me joining the Royal Marines and having to wait four or five years to fire the weapon system that I'll, I always wanted to do. You know, it's um, it's testament to their guys, uh, to these guys, you know, the, the professionalism and their the resilience as well to be able to withdraw, with, withdraw themselves from um, the, the want of getting of getting there quick. You know, it's not going to take it's not going to take two minutes. It's going to it's going to be a long um, drawn out process. And uh, you've got to have a lot of patience for that, guys. And uh, Dare I say it, the intellect probably helps them have that patience, you know. You've got to be an articulate in individual um, capable of having that, you know, determination to see the task through to the end. Four or five years, you know, I mean, my career was a little longer than that, nearly six years, you know, and, and they're spending that training. So credit to them, like, I have so much respect for these guys. Vi på fyra, fem år. Det är på något sätt det vi har väntat på. Stora förväntningar. Ja, vad kul. Det ska bli jätteroligt att flyga mer på demopasset. Där är ju vi instruktörer som kommer visa vad 39 går för. Ni ska bara sitta där och njuta av åkturen helt enkelt. Första gången ni sitter i stridsflyg också. Ett riktigt stridsflyg. Det känns bra. Eh, nervös såklart. Det, det är eh, en lång väg hit och vi har sett fram emot det väldigt länge. Eh, jag måste säga att jag är väl mer nervös nu än vad jag var när jag flög själv första gången. Eh, det kommer vara en liten häftigare maskin och lite, lite roligare tror jag. I'm so excited to see how they react. This is brilliant. Get some likes in the chat. Let's like this video. Last sprint up on here. Nej, fan, det är sjukt känslan att du, du är här. 
Nu är vi här. <laughs> Spider One Three. Go ahead. Yeah. That would be to uh, uh, the three niners coming on the runway behind you. I have to say, guys, I'm, I don't I don't know much about aircraft and stuff, but that thing looks absolutely incredible, man. No wonder they're excited. I'm excited. I'm not even a pilot. And expect departure in uh, three minutes to do uh, a um, lower approach Fantastic. on uh, runway uh, one niner. Zero one vänder snyggt. Vad säger du? Zero one vänder snyggt när man kommer in. Det är en halvbana, ja. Det är fan sjukt. Runway uh, two niner, clear for takeoff. Runway two niner, clear for takeoff, Spider-One. Då gjorde jag. Yep. Håll jag på rasarna. Here we go, this thing's gonna be fast. Då åker vi. Kör in. Wow. That's unbelievable. That is incredible. Are you ready? Yep. Do you want to turn this up? Oh, great. Wow. So there. How does it feel? The body feels great. That's incredible. The body feels great. Yes. So there. Vi tar en till roll, de är fan nice alltså. Vi kan göra tre stycken. På rad. Då tar vi en roll då. Ja. Kommer åt vänster. Yes. Är du med? Ja. Det är så sjukt. Åh oh, satan. Det där var bra rollen. Ja. Alltså. I was wondering what he was saying, take a roll. I didn't know what he was on about then he did that. But man, that was... That... It doesn't get it doesn't get as good as that man. That that's got that's the best job in the world, guys. I would love to be a pilot, man. That looks absolutely unbelievable. If you've been a pilot and you're watching this, I envy you. Yeah, that's it's one of the better parts of the military, man. That's the wrong. Oh, that's the wrong. So we mark up on it and looping on it. Yeah, that's. I'm gonna hold this marker now. To now, I'm Alpha 17. Jag har tappat till mig i satt och bjöd. 4G har vi. Tar vi en EBK istället. Det blir en liten tunnelroll ut här. <laughs> alltså det är så jävla coolt. Det är okej. Okay. Ja. Jag stiger upp lite, får du flyga lite? Ja, stoppar. Ta lite fart. Känns det okej? Okay? Känns jättebra. Du flyger. Jag flyger. Oh wow, so he's taking control now. That's, that's unbelievable. Den ni blir säkert snabb. Ja, den är kaxig. Alltså det är... Får vi ta ett jobb? Det är Eller hur? Ja, det är otroligt. Det är nice. Wow. <laughs> jag är inte van med den där. Nej, jag förstår det. Jag Ska vi ändra runt 180 grader sakta mot för ettan? Vi ska hålla oss över marken här i bukten. Ja. Så, flyga, flyga. Är du nöjd? Ja. Ska vi åka hem? Ja, jag är nöjd. Bra, jag tar en fält out. Spider-1-3, här ställer vi west och southwest. Southwest in the right side. Spider-1-3, här vi är R2B. Kom igen. Känns bra? Ja, känns bra. Har du gripen centrum där nere? Jajamän. Till höger, tornet, plattorna. Right guys, I know I haven't talked an awful lot during that 
that bit there where they're up in the air. But honestly, guys, I'm 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 gobsmacked. Like I'm truly and uh, captivated with this kind of um, footage. You know, seeing it for the first time as well. Um, I'm just picturing myself what that feeling must be like as I'm trying to relate it to the feelings I had when I was in the Marines and you know the first experiences I had in there. What what I can compare them with, you know, or the first time I rode in a helicopter, the first time I fired a, a machine gun, the first time I threw a grenade, the first time I you know jumped off a helicopter onto a ship at night, the first time I cross decked from a smaller ship to a bigger ship at night. You know, all of these things um, were fantastically overwhelming in a good way. So. That that must just that you know you're never gonna forget that put it that way you're never gonna forget your first time doing this 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 is incredible man get some love in the chat guys yeah smash the like button if you're still with us right now please 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 hit the like button guys. Are you ready? Yep. Go bro. Hey guys, bro. Gå ju lite snabbare än för uh, sexy. Eller hur? Det tar vi Spider-1-3 on right. Vi svanar in igen. Spider-1-3, swing from line 4 till degrees 1-5 knots. Ram med bara 9-1 kill land. Så har jag haft Wonderful. vissa kompisar som har frågat hur det har varit att flyga då första gången. Och jag säger att det är, visst, det är ett flygplan då som SK-60 och som andra flygplan, men det är som att köra en gammal Amazon eller en Ferrari. Att det, det är väldigt mycket roligare. Yeah, so, you know, they've been driving around in like the old BMW for a bit and now they they've they've took like they've took the Porsche out, haven't they, you know? They've just took a supercar out for a ride. Incredible, man. Look at the cheesy grins on the face, man. Det var det var häftigt. Jag skulle säga långt häftigt än vad jag trodde det skulle vara. Den känslan att få äntligen sitta i cockpiten och känna kraften och känna hur hur fort det går. Det var väldigt fett, ska man säga. Wow, 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 wow. Guys, let's have a chat about this right now. Oh man, so. That was the best episode so far, as far as I'm concerned. I really, really enjoyed that one. Um, let me know if you did too. If you disagree with me, if you didn't think it was the best episode for me, that was, um, you know, I wasn't talking much in that one, but for a good reason. It's, I just didn't feel the need to. When they're in the air, you know, I just wanted to enjoy that, and I really, really, really did. That, I don't know. I'm just trying to picture myself what it would be like. It's one of it's like one of these things where you think, "Wow, I want to do that." And I'm I'm not joking, guys. I would I would love to do that if in an ideal world I had the opportunity to maybe go back in time and and do that. I would definitely pursue that as a career. I'm not even joking. It looks fantastic. I'm proud of being a Royal Marine. Really, really proud. And I would I would always have went the route to get one of these berets, you know, and to become a Royal Marines commando. But it's like um, I would I would have loved to have done that. I would have loved to have done that. To see you're a pilot in my eyes, in the military is like one of the highest honors. You know, well, I can fly, I can fly a, a jet. I mean, that's amazing, isn't it? Really. Um, so credit to anyone who's aspiring to be one of these guys. I say go for it. Go for it. You only live once. Don't let time pass you by. Go and get your um, go and get what you what you deserve, and go go reach for the stars, man. Yeah, or reach for the. You can certainly reach for the stars on one of those things. So if you did like this video, make sure you like, share, and subscribe to the channel, guys. Yeah, I really, really do appreciate each and every one of you. Um, if you want to become a member or if you have become a member during um, this video, tier 1, tier 2, tier 3, the memberships are pretty cheap, guys, all right, for a monthly um, fee, then I, re I really, really appreciate it. All right, um, I am trying to do this full-time now. Um, so thank you, guys, if you 
if you're considering or if you have become a member. And while we're on the members, thank you guys again below. I really appreciate every single one of you guys. Discord, Twitch, Twitter, merchandise, Instagram and Discord um, and TikTok, sorry, is all available down below as a link. Click on that and please click on my um, second and third channel, guys. Gendit Gaming and Gendit Commando. Uh, Gendit Podcast will be in the chat right now. Please just click on it and subscribe it and show some uh, support troops, okay? But I really look forward to episode nine. That'll be tomorrow. Peace out, guys. Love is all. Bye.